Today was a great day of celebration and joy at Congregation Bethel, a wonderful bar mitzvah, hundreds of people there to celebrate Shabbos, a beautiful couple celebrating their ufruf as they are about to begin married life together. But 300 miles away, in a conservative synagogue, much like our own, their simcha turned to tragedy. Now that Shabbos is over, I have learned the grim details of the loss of life in a conservative synagogue, an egalitarian conservative synagogue, very much like our own. It is with sadness that we mourn the loss of life. Later, as Shabbos was nearing its end, I came to shul, and in our minion, there were more than three times the regular number of attendees. Instinctively, the members of our congregation knew that in challenging times like this, it is precisely to the synagogue that we must return. Some would stay away, fearing for their safety. But you, our loyal members of Bethel, know that your safety is paramount, of paramount importance to us. We have an armed guard. Unfortunately, we need to, but we have an armed guard at every single one of our services at synagogue. But seeing so many people at our minion tonight made me feel so strong inside because we understand as Jewish people that no one can undermine our faith. No one can destroy our sense of community. We are a resilient people and we will rebound from this challenge as we have so many others in our past, both ancient and modern. And so I urge you to come back to the synagogue to be with us, to join together in community, to show the strength of solidarity. Our morning services, I'm proud to say, nine o'clock tomorrow morning, six o'clock tomorrow night, and all week as well. We will have our services as scheduled, and I have a feeling that they will be well attended. In addition, Congregation Bethel will be hosting tomorrow night, Sunday night, at 7 p.m., a vigil to stand with, in solidarity with those who have suffered in Pittsburgh, to mourn their loss and to tell them that they do not grieve alone, that we are in fact a strong and vibrant people, a conservative movement that is proud to perpetuate the traditions of our ancestors, to safeguard the values and ideals that our parents, grandparents and great grandparents instilled in us, and that we will in turn pass on to our children our grandchildren, and generations yet unknown. Am Yisroel Chai, the Jewish people stand together. I look forward to standing with you, to studying with you, to singing with you, to davening with you in our shul, a safe, comfortable place in which we can all feel at home.